Hi, I'm Stephen, and welcome to Devoted, a devotional series where I seek to take one verse and, within context, encourage you, challenge you, and comfort you in the love of Jesus. All within five minutes. Today's verse is Psalm 27, verse 1. And David writes, through the inspiration of the Holy Spirit, The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? Uh, I have some fears in my life. One, one of my biggest fears is uh, heights. I'm really afraid of being up in high places, and maybe you uh, have a fear like that. Maybe your fears are a little different. But if we kind of nail down what my fear actually is. It's not as much just being up in heights, even though that does cause a lot of fear. Uh, it's more the idea of falling. Um, I don't enjoy that, and uh, the thought of it terrifies me. And it doesn't matter how high up I am, actually. Uh, I can be on the ground, and if I trip, it, it, it startles me a lot. And so one thing that I really don't like because of that is being in darkness. When it's all dark around me, I am afraid not of the dark itself, because I know the dark is not uh, going to hurt me. I know it can't do anything to me, but what I'm afraid is that I'm going to find a way to trip over something, run into something, and end up falling. And so I love having light on. And the truth is, light is good for us um, within our stability. It allows us to be able to see what's all around us. It allows us to be able to understand things and where they are and what they are. And so it creates in us a, a steadiness. And the question is, what is it in our life that actually gives that to us? Uh, light is an example of it, but what is that light, true light for us? And David, as he's writing this, uh, the context is he's being pursued and he's in danger. And yet he looks to the Lord as his light and his salvation. The Lord is his, his firm place to stand. The Lord is what allows him to be able to have courage in the midst of all of that. And so he says it. He says, the Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? And then he goes into talking more in strategic army terms. The Lord is my stronghold. He is my shelter. He is where I go when there is danger around me. And I hope that in my life I go there too that I trust in the Lord. And when I do that, that question of whom shall I fear and whom shall I be afraid, the answer is nobody. Nobody. Uh, I was listening to a song earlier this week and it said, my fears are afraid of you. The things that I'm afraid of in this world cannot compare to the light of God. And so I need to trust in Him. And even when I have these things that scare me, um, whether it's heights or falling or death or acceptance, rejection, I can look to the Lord and He can be my stability. He can be my light and my salvation. He can be my stronghold. And because of that, I can trust Him and I can live a life that is different than what a lot of people do in this world when they're trusting in things that will not hold them up. Uh, it scares us. And so we put our trust in the Lord. And as David continues writing, he says, you know, even though there's evil all around me, even though people pursue me, again, he remembers that God is the place he can go, the person he can trust, and the one who can means a lot to me as I read this, but I hopefully it encourages you as well. And I appreciate you checking in and watching and uh, 
Hope to see you next time. Thanks. Bye.